<sighs> oh, hi, how you doing? Not me, ya. Nice to meet ya. Oh, got the hair. It's good, isn't it? Anyway, I'm uh, talking through a few things about our films, you know, strengths and weaknesses, you know, which one we're going to choose and why. Let's begin anyway. Let's begin, yeah? Okay. So, our ideas are, oh, look, look at this, sir. Into the wild. Don't don't question why we filmed that. Filmed that. Why we named that. It just happened. And good old uh, Lucy Dreaming. First of all, let's talk about these bad boys, shouldn't we? Yeah. So, into the wild. You can't really because you know they look weird through the mirror and that. Anyway, this film is based about a man. Yes, a man. A very successful man. Yes, indeed. You know, who doesn't know a lot about his past. Poor bloke, right? And he sets out. To find out who he really is, you know, he's always had that feeling he's, he's not a normal man, he's a bit different to everyone else. So he sets out to find who he really is, you know, and he turns out to be part of a tribe, you know, an ancient ancient tribe who's been wiped out. And he sets out to find them, and when he does, do not look too bright for him, does it? Yeah, that's the gist of the film. About Lucy Dreaming, basically. Based around a guy, can be a woman as well, you know, I'm not, I'm not being sexist at all. Anyway, this film is about this guy who uh, basically uses lucid dreaming to um, mourn his wife in a way. He goes back, spends memories with her, you know, because she's passed away and that, and he wants her to relive those happy days and that. So he does, and he becomes addicted to it. And, you know, when you become addicted to it, no, normally not that good, is it? So, yeah, bad stuff happens to him. We never really decided what happened, but, you know, it could be the simple. He died, or you know, went in a coma, or it was all a dream. Ooh, is a dream within a dream. Da da da. Wow. Anyway, so you may be wondering who thought of this wacky idea, huh? Oh, that's right. Me. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Let's move on. So we're using cups of teas because you know everyone loves a cup of tea. If you don't, you're a weirdo. Let's begin. So. First of all, got the old tea bag. Boom. Shwedas. Now, I want to talk about the good old shrimps of this film. Ah, oh, can you see this? I don't know, see it. Like, yeah, look, the old shrimps, look, good old bulbons. So, let's begin with Into the Wild. Now, the shrimps with this film. I said it's very clear. The narrative, you know, it's going to be easy. It's going to be easy to uh, basically go on. The audience is clear. Mm. I think it was very original, you know, I don't think I've seen many A-level students doing this, who's going to be very creative. And for it, let's carry on. It plays with emotion, yeah, you know, not a lot of films do that. And normally it's like horrors and that, and it's a bit scary, or it's a bit, oh, that's a bit gory. You don't want to tug at the old art strings a bit. Oh, and uh, the next one, oh yeah, we said, um, we can go anywhere with it, right? We said we've got to stick to tribes and that. We can use government. Everyone loves a bit of government, don't they? Let's go and move on. So we've got the old shrimps. Now what's the shrimps of a good old Lucy Dreaming then? Well, I feel then it was a very original idea. Don't you think yourself? Because look, I'm reading it off here because I'm just practicing and that. Yeah, so I think it's original. Do you see many kids doing films based around dreams and that? And using mad editing and that to make it look really good? No, I, I know you don't. But we might. Who knows? And the next one, uh, oh yeah, I said about the ending. There's no restriction, we can go where we want with this. It could be do anything with it. That's why I think it's really open with us. I think it's pretty decent. And the last one, we get to play with the mind. Yeah, good isn't it? Good thing I'll go anywhere. We'll do it. You know what I mean? Like, is he going to be in Dream? Is he not going to be in Dream? How would the audience know? A bit like Inception. Totally not ripping it off. Let's move on. So we got the old shrimps. So we got three shrimps for Lucy Dreaming. Look, oh, bang. Bang, bang. Oh, how many shrimps we got for this one? Ooh. Oh, we've got cheeky four. Let's get that one. You know what? We're going to bang the kill one while we Bang, 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 bang. Good, isn't it? Alright, let's. That's a bit loud. We're going to turn that off and pretend that is boiling. You know, 
Boy them all, that's a bit overrated. We like a cold tea here, don't we? Let's let's see what the what the weakness. Oh, what's the weakness? Oh, milk. Where's my nut? Oh, look, there they are. They're in the fridge. Came off. This is very budget, and I'm only doing it in one take, so I can't bother to redo it. Let's go on. So, got weakness, you know. Think about it. Strong tea, strong film. Let's go. So, boom, boom. So it's boiled. Oh shit! Sorry for the language. So, oh, oh. Let's talk about good old into the wild. So, what we said for this one? Oh, I can't multitask. I'm sorry. So we said about this is that we feel that we're going to need a budget. You know, we're going to be. We want to film in a rainforest in that. There's no rainforest around here. We've got Epin Forest. I don't think that's going to be very well for budget-wise, and I don't think it'll look that good. I think it'll just look like a normal school film, which I don't really want. And then we said about uh, the idea that, is it going to drag a bit? There's going to be a lot of filler in there, you know. I think it might get a bit boring or what so. And uh, then we said about the idea, will it be engaging? Who knows? Would it, is it an engaging ending? You know, is it going to really pull the audience in? So, you know, we got three weaknesses so what's that gonna be three drops bang oh shit that's that was that was a lot of milk that's three drops okay so lucid dream where's my nut yes so we said the same thing really with this is it gonna be boring you know go from dream to dream Ooh, that's fun isn't it yeah seeing memories oh that's lovely like i really want to see a couple and they're falling in love and that boring anyway we said Oh, the ending. Be a bit predictable, won't it? You know what I mean? You know, it's like, oh, oh, it's all a dream. Oh, based on dreams. It must be a dream. So, look, one, two. See, this is better. I'm getting there. And then, look, we said, can't really go anywhere with a narrative, you know? We're stuck with that narrative, if you get what I mean, you know? Like, with the other idea, we can sort of go anywhere with this. This one, we have to stick to dreams and kind of be a bit boring. Weakness in my eyes. Yes, and the last one, we said the same thing, I mean, links to, to the first point, a lot of filler. If you get what I mean, like, it's just going to drag, it's going to be filmed, it's going to be all these dreams and that, and it's going to get a bit boring and that. So I just feel like it's going to be a bit, ugh, icky and that. So, tea bag, oh, bosh. Right, let's see which one's stronger. Oh, you like this? Oh, I can't get the tea bag out, I'm sorry. Ta oh, what? Oh, oh. Now let's have a look. Should we analyse? I think uh, we should analyse. Let's bring the T's over here. Can you see that? Can you see me? Can you see the T's? Oh, yes, you can. Oh, there's me. Now, looking at this, I think we have a clear winner, don't you? I think that they're both pretty equal. They both have their strengths and weaknesses. But, I feel Into the Wild is a stronger film. And that's my decision. Thank you for watching. That's a strong